what's going on guys how's everybody doing today i'm doing well thank you for asking if i'd be down here on this wednesday afternoon uh, today we're going to be doing some elevated deadlifts and that's it i'm not going to be going all that heavy i don't know what i'm going to go to but i know i'll do 405 and uh <clears throat> and that's all we're going to do today some elevated deadlifts so having some storms blow through and the power might go out it flicked once already we got tornadoes around us and or, yeah tornadoes around us some have been spotted kind of in neighboring counties and we've had hail and lots of rain just all of a sudden and so that's just another day in the life in Tennessee and uh, most of the south so anyway Let's go ahead and get started on our deadlifts and uh, get this over and done. There you go guys just like that we got another workout in the books uh, as you see I didn't do anything crazy again I've already met my goal a handful of times with my deadlifts with the 500 pound deadlift from the floor and uh, a few times from the elevated position and uh, I'm just kind of doing things differently and not going for the super heavy anymore and uh, that way I'm not so stressed mentally, I'm not so stressed physically and, and everything. Deadlifts wear me out. It's my hardest lift by far and I mean like inside and out in my brain. I'm going to kill two little gnats right here. 
and I probably missed them. I didn't want to hit my monitor. <laughs> anyway. So, yeah, we went up to 475, which I'm perfectly fine with that. And uh, if you've never done the elevated deadlifts, I recommend them. Uh, not just for training to move heavier weight, but training in general. It's a good way to get uh, for this particular situation here about a good two inches uh, that I don't have to go down. So that's what she said. But anyway, so it's just a good way to train and to still get in 99% of the deadlift movement and uh, still get a good workout. Uh, so as of right now, it looks like the storms have passed. Um, <coughs> don't know what else we'll get, but we got storm shelters open and stuff, so uh, we'll see what happens. And I've been dealing with this little cough for the past couple of days that I got from somebody, probably my wife. Because <coughs> for once, my grandkids didn't look sick. They didn't sound sick. Usually my grandkids are always sick. So, anyway... Uh, like, share, subscribe, comment, all that good stuff to the Body Beatdown. That's me, Michael. And uh, we're going to live to tell another story and put another piece of this puzzle in the book tomorrow. All right? Get up, get out, get red. Do it we'll see you next time on the Body Beatdown. Get up, get out, get red, and do it, do it!